Good afternoon, this is Eric Bertram with Apex CCTV. Welcome to our training video on how to configure the GeoVision Center V2 system to accept incoming client connections. Well, the first thing we need to do is just launch the Center V2 system. So we'll double click the icon. And on the right side of the interface, uh, under all the administration buttons, on the top row, the third button says accounts, that's the address book. We click on this. <coughs> and we load up the address book. Now right now we have no groups and no hosts configured so I'm going to go ahead and add a group. We'll call this demonstration, demonstration DVRs. <clears throat> and inside that group I'm going to add a subscriber. And a subscriber is basically any GeoVision device that's going to have permission to log into our, DV, into our Center V2 system. So our first device is just going to be called GeoDemo. I'll give it a password and a name. And the rest of this information is optional. You can fill it out if you like. I'm going to skip it. But you can put a physical address, email address, a home phone number, an office phone number, a mobile fax number, and a pager. And this information can be used by a monitoring operator to get in touch with somebody on location uh, with the DVR if there's a problem like the cameras are down or someone is trying to break in or someone's there after hours that shouldn't be, uh, etc. This information will all come up under the subscriber information if you double click on a video feed or double click on an event in the task list. So I'm going to go ahead and close this now and uh, I'll just accept the default subscriber settings for now and click OK and close the address book. And we've actually done everything that we need to do here for a subscriber to be, or be able to connect. So let's go ahead and, and uh, double check that so I'll minimize this interface. And uh, I'm going to use Control Center which you may or may not have but you can do this at your DVR's interface too. But I'm just going to connect to the remote DVR on my GeoVision demo. And this will allow me to, to control all the settings in the GeoVision software as though I were sitting there at the desk. Now I've already con con uh, configured my Center V2 client with the correct username, password, and IP address for my Center V2 system. So all I need to do is click on this networking icon, go down here and, and click on connect to Center V2, and it should connect right up. Oops, like I got a password error. Oh, mistyped my username there. We'll try this again. And we click connect one more time. And I can get out of my uh, remote DVR software by clicking the uh, admin button on the bottom left and then the exit, exit command. And if I reopen my Center V2, I should have some cameras connecting. I've got it set to connect uh, only when there's motion. So these are some outdoor cameras around the office, and we're seeing you know, trees blowing in the wind, etc. And that's it. It's that simple. Uh, look for another training video shortly on how to configure the DVR side of this setup. And thank you for choosing Apex CCTV.